What is going on everybody and welcome to a brand new squad building challenge cheapest solution My name is elite and if you're new to the channel I do these all the time for any squad building challenges you need I have missed a couple in the past month uh, I missed the player of the months and uh, so far I don't have Balak out yet, but I should have him soon Anyways, Rui Costa is overall the most worth prime icon SBC that I've seen so far, in my opinion. I'll also, Sol Campbell is, is, is good, and Balak, you know, he's one of the better prime icons, so you can determine whether that's worth it for you or not. But he's only going to be 630,000 coins, guys, and that's before you even get packs in return, and you get some pretty good packs too. So if you compare that to the other prime icons, especially the ones in the prime icon sets that we had in 1, 2, and 3, definitely more worth it than any of them so if this does end up helping you guys out to get this prime icon Rui costa all i ask in return guys is drop a like on the video and subscribe if you're new those are both free and easy things that you guys can do to support me and you know i'm gonna continue to help you guys out so it's a win-win situation there um so the first one is world class and you guys might have noticed i skipped over humble beginnings and rising talent basically you just go with bronze rares from like the norwegian league the mls same thing with the silvers guys that's how you do that um but i'm not going to go ahead and do a squad for you guys because i know if i use bronze rares and, and silver rares they're gonna get price fixed so i want to stick to the gold sbcs and those are easy enough you should be able to hopefully figure them out on your own anyways for the world class sbc you are going to need all gold you are going to need nine rare players, two team of the week, and 70 chemistry. So for this one, guys, what you're going to want to do is pick a league. I picked La Liga and built basically the whole squad with La Liga rare cards, and it ends up being very cheap. And the informs you use, just use the cheapest informs in the game, and it doesn't even matter what position they are. So you guys go find the cheapest gold inform in the game. I used Lolly, and then I also used Korber, all right? So those are the guys I went with, and this is what the squad ends up looking like. So we go Kiko Casilla, we go Lolly at left back, Alvaro, he's going to play center back right here. Then we're going to go with Mandy at uh, center back there, and I cannot figure out how to get these guys in the right position right now. Port 2 is going to play right back, and then our first CDM card is going to be Yokozlu. Diop's going to play the other CDM. Then we've got Dennis Suarez at cam, and then the other center attacking man is going to be Raul Garcia. Banyat's going to play on the right side, and then our striker, again, is the cheapest inform of the game right now. Korver, 75 rated inform. So what you guys notice is that, yes, we used all rare players and then two team of the weeks because team of the week cards don't count as rare cards. So you have to go full rare. You can't use any non-rare golds, guys. And you get a 15k pack in return. It's going to cost you approximately 28,000 coins for this squad building challenge. So don't expect to make profit on it but it is not one of the more expensive ones in the SBC. Next up, we've got the 83 rated squad where we need one team of the week card, and you also get a prime gold players pack in return. That's a 45,000 coin pack. I don't really like those packs too much. I don't really get too lucky with those kind of packs. Um, I prefer 50Ks, 55Ks, and even 35Ks over 45K packs. Um, Subasic is going to be our first player, and then our inform is going to play left back. You can go Butel. You can also go with Benitez. They're both 81-rated goalkeepers from League One, so you can go with either one. Glick's going to play center back, and then we're going to go with Rami at right center back. Danny Alves is going to play right back, and you guys notice we don't even use a single uh, player above 84-rated in this squad, and we only use one 84 rated as well. So it's very, very cheap solution for this one. We're going to go with Strootman and then at center attacking mid. We're going to actually go with Arthur there. He's going to need that link with Willian Jose. And then we're going to go with Giuliano over at right center mid, a very cheap 83 rated. Willian Jose, as I said, left striker. Get that strong link with Arthur. And then we're going to finish it off with our 84 rated, one of the cheaper 84s in the game. The cheapest 84s in the game are all goalkeepers, players like Ruffier, players like um, Hredetsky. Uh, but in terms of field players, this is actually the uh, second cheapest uh, field player at the 84 rating, Jonas there. So very cheap solution for the 83 rated squad. Let's keep it going. Next squad building challenge, guys. 84 rated. We need a uh, we need an 84 rating, 80 chemistry, and two team of the week players. You get a rare players pack in return. That's a 50k pack as well, guys. So we're only at the 84 rated squad, and we're already getting some pretty good packs in return. Um, but obviously... On none of these SBCs are you really expecting to to make any profit on it because even though you are getting a, a 50k pack in return, it is going to cost you like 
68 to 70,000 coins to complete it anyways. Uh, so we actually use Benitez in this squad. I just swapped it out because they're pretty much the same price. Again, you can use Butel if you want in this squad building challenge. We're going to go with Falcao at left back. We're going to go with Glick with that strong link with Falcao. Then we're going to go with Marquinhos. I don't really love using Marquinhos in SPCs because... Quite honestly, he's like almost double the price of Glick. Glick's like 3K, Marquinhos is like 6K. But um, Marquinhos is going to, um, actually Glick isn't even 3K. Glick is way, way less than 3K. Uh, but Marquinhos is 6K and, and that is not one of the cheapest 84s in the game. He's simply there for the chemistry links because we do uh, end up needing 80 chem. Lopez is going to play right back, and then we're going to go with Luis Gustavo at CDM. We're going to go with Torre. He's going to be our uh, first inform, uh, or actually second inform because we use Benitez at goalkeeper. We're going to use Torre. Abdullahi Torre is going to play CDM right there, and uh, that'll be our second inform for the squad. We're going to go with Dimitri Paye. He's going to play left mid, guys, and you need to get the position change on him. I'll show you in a second. Fakir and then Thalvin. To finish off there, and then we're going to go with Benzema up top at striker, uh, rather than going with another striker from League One. We do need to get Paye in position at center mid. So center attacking mid is center mid. The position chain card costs about 1,800 coins, and I factored that into the squad as well, guys. I factored that into the squad as well. So make sure to go ahead and get that position change card. Next up, we've got the 85 rated squad, which needs two Team of the Week cards and a 70 chemistry so for this squad i decided to go once again with league one and the only card of league one that is like overly priced is marquinhos and yes we have to use them again but that saves us money in the long run because we use a ton of cheap cards for their ratings so rufier is actually one of the cheapest 84s in the game him and hredetsky are the cheapest uh 84s in the game and then we're going to go with 83 rated Vita at left center back. We're going to go with Marquinhos at center back. And then Buffon is going to play right here. He's going to be our real high rated card for the squad so that we can go with a bunch of 84s and 83s throughout in an 85 overall squad. We're going to go with Thalvin at right back. And then Sule Mani. Sule Mani is going to play left midfielder. Then we're going to go with Strutman at center mid. Paye is going to play center attacking mid. And then we're going to go with Verratti, another higher rated card at center mid. Then we get to go with Di Maria, who's a cheap 84, and Falcao, who's a cheap 85, to complete the squad. And we get exactly 85 rating with 71 chemistry in the squad. You get a jumbo premium gold players pack in return, which is twice a 25k pack. So it's 25k pack, and then they double the size of that. So it's not necessarily a 50k pack. But the overall value on the market, like if you were to buy it from the store, would be 50,000 coins, um, if that makes any sense. Two more SBCs for this, guys. This one gives a 55k pack, the rare mega packs. I like the rare mega packs. It's basically you just take a 35k pack, you make them all rare. Um, and, it's, and it's one of the better packs in the game. I really like those packs. Um, but we need an 86 rating. The good news is there's no inform requirements. So as opposed to like the Soul Campbell icon SBC, there's no inform requirements on the 86 or 87 rated squad, which is going to save you a ton of coins. So here are the players you're going to need. We're going to go with Neto at goalkeeper. Uh, we're going to go with Fredetsky at left back. We're going to go with Diego Godin and 90 rated cards. We only go with two higher rated cards uh, or three higher rated cards in this squad. It's going to be Godin, Navas, and Iniesta. And then that allows us to go with a bunch of 83s and 84s for the rest of the squad. Definitely saves us some coins. Savage is going to play right center back. Very cheap. Navas is going to play right back. Uh, once again, I hate going with fullbacks for the most part. Next up, we're going to go with Thiago at uh, left center mid to get the link with Fredetsky. Then we're going to go with Alara Mendy at center mid. And William Carvalho is going to play right center mid. Iniesta is going to play left winger here. Then we're going to go with Gerard Moreno and Sergio Asenio to finish off the squad, guys. And we have exactly 86 rating, exactly 70 chemistry. No loyalty, no position change needed for this squad, guys. Um, and then to finish it off, guys, the 87 rated squad is only needing 60 chemistry. So you basically just want to go with the cheapest cards that you can find for each rating. So what I do is I go with three higher rated cards, um, which are, or I go with four higher rated cards actually, because it is an 87 rating. We go with Ter Stegen, we go with Handanovic, we go with David Silva, and we go with Isco. And then that allows us to not go with any 87s or any 86 rated cards. And then we actually get to go with a couple of 84s to save a lot of coins. We actually get to go with uh, four 84 rated cards and three 85 rated cards. So in the end, it, it does save a few coins um, by going with the higher rated golds and then uh, getting to use the lower rated golds 
uh, as well. So Ter Stegen's going to play goalkeeper. We're going to go with Arturo Vidal at center back. Jimenez is going to play at the central center back. And then right center back is going to be Neto. And Danovic is going to play at left mid because he's the cheapest 88 in the game. If Iniesta is the cheapest 88 in the game at the time you're watching this or Buffon, go ahead and use them there instead. But Handanovic is the cheapest right now. Alara Mendy is going to play center defensive mid. And then we're also going to play CDM for Isco. Then at right mid, we're going to go with Ibrahimovic. At Cam, we're going with David Silva. And the strikers are going to be Diego Costa and Rodrigo. And since we only need 60 chemistry, we're allowed to go with all these players out of position. We're allowed to go with our left mid and right mid uh, completely on no chemistry. And we still end up with 64 chemistry. So that is the cheapest solution for the new Rui Costa Prime Icon Squad Building Challenge. And if you made it to the end of the video, I want you to type Elite RTG, the, the, the name of my club right now, Elite RTG in the comment section below. And that'll tell me who the real ones are. Um, I definitely want to see how many people made it to the end of the video. And also, if you guys don't know what the Elite R uh, Road to Glory is yet, it's a brand new series on my channel. So do not miss it. We're only two episodes in. Um, it's easy to catch up on two episodes. Go ahead and watch those guys if you have not seen them yet. Anyways, that's going to be the end of this video. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I will see you in the next one, guys. Peace out.